Hey there everyone, welcome back to another episode of Dead Island 2. I'm Captain Beefy, this is the Game Vault, and we're doing some post-story content right now. We are back in Ocean Avenue area at the uh, hotel, and we're going to start another side mission up, so let's cue up the music, and we'll get down to it. All right, Rosa. You're the one who goes out all me? over the city, right? Yeah, I'm kind of dumb like that. Got a tip for you. I heard there's some kind of military stash down in the metro. Oh, yeah? How'd you hear that? From a friend. He ran with this gang, had a hideout down there, like the disused part where all the busted train cars end up. You might find something good. Great. This someone got a name? Diego. I'll have a look around while I'm down there. See if there's any sign of him. All right, the art of war. <clears throat> so, it's a good little side mission. We'll get that going. We got some missing persons up here we have to get to. Jimmy Montana, who's Fuck very it. angry. Hey, Jimmy. See? Um, <laughs> Did you out the zombies on your way down? We got to talk to him. <laughs> I'm sorry. He's an angry fellow. <clears throat> Looks like Judd Nelson, though. Don't like him building up out there. All right. Well, let's head on down to the metro, and we're gonna see. I think this leads to another weapon. I'm not sure which one. We got the big shot in the last episode, which is a great little weapon. We're gonna have some fun playing with that one today. Rosa said the gang hung out by some old train. So that'll be a lot of fun. Let's actually get that one equipped, just for the fun of it. Yeah, broken train cars, military station. All right. Yeah, check this thing out. This looks right. So, where's the army stash? It's kind of spectacular, right? Go to hell. Yeah, the only problem is it's only three shots. Yeah, it can be quite a lot of fun using uh, guns in this game, you know. Even though it's, I think the game really shines with its melee, the guns are a lot of fun too. Especially once you start getting some really good guns. So we're going to have to look through these cars and around this area and see what's up. Um, if memory serves, it's somewhere down in this area. A laptop. Yep, flat. there it is. Two percent. Huh. Well, I guess I'll be killing zombies for the next hour. <laughs> it doesn't take that long, but boy, it sure feels that way. in the leg and everything's copacetic for a moment. I'll have a nice little drink. Up, up. There's the second round. We'll just keep braining him, keep our back to the wall here. Thank you. 
How we doing? Still downloading. On your piece of shit laptop. Goodbye. I'm gonna take a hammer to it in a minute. Cause you know what's gonna happen. Eventually, gonna get a nice, like, a mutilator, or a mutator, or a. Oh, what do you call it? What are the big guy? Here comes the first big guy. Let's finish him off, hopefully. My timing there. Did I kill her? Nope. Alright, that time did. Still alive? Yep. There you go. I knew it. I knew it. Come on, let's get this guy finished off. Come on. Dead. Finally. All right. What else we got? Oh. Some kind of art project. Diego. <laughs> Supplies in the train cars. This must be it. Alright, so let's we'll do that, but first off we're gonna clean up. Cause yeah, we left a ton of crap laying around here. Nice weapons to you know break down or sell. Stash box that's shared amongst every single player on the account. So if you start a second player and you got weapons in there, he'll be able to access them and potentially sell them. And that, my friends, is a monster itself. Burn, baby. All right. There you go, you two. We got something good here. Yeah, during, uh, between this episode and the last one, I went ahead and sold a lot of excessive, uh, resources that we had. Because, you know, sitting at 99 and every time they would drop, then they would just drop on the ground. I was unable to pick them up. And that's kind of a waste, you know. direction we want to go. Anyway, oh, here we go. Let's 
go ahead and go in there and see if there's anything worthwhile. I don't remember. I know we've been in here before. Shut off the electricity in there. Okay. Yeah, not much special in there, so we'll move forward. Plenty of water. Get rid of all the acid. At least that's the plan. Come on. track. That's right, rabbit. Something? Yeah, we missed something on here. Okay. Some kind of supplies. A big fat nothing. Yeah, we still got a couple other spots to check out. Let's check this one. Check on this car here. Looks like we got that one to look at as well. open for an empty box. Kill me. He did, he killed me. I'm getting killed more in the post game. I'm just screwing around so much though, but still, that's not an excuse, man. Come on. This is embarrassing. Alright.
Putrid subway car keys. Now we gotta kinda get our bearings again and see where we were. We were that way? I guess we were. So, they were a street art crew. Sounds like they had a major bust up. I wonder what happened to Rose's friend. So they're over here? Okay. Find the D and D crew rebels. DBD. Hey guys. Afraid we'll be spraying these walls with your blood. Shots here. Use that bugger. Right in the guts. Did you kill me? And then boom! Now you've all died for your art. Who's got the stash? That's right, that's me, and I think it's that box right there. It's pretty gross in here. Sounds like somebody's running around behind me. Alright, so we get another Newman card. Let's go ahead and look at that real quick. So we can get another one equipped. Autophage, go bigger, go home, gain a moderate boost critical damage, an even bigger boost when your health is low but your toughness is reduced. Yeah, let's do that one. And we'll fix this. We'll fix that. No way to fast travel out of here. So we'll go back to quests and let's do the body art one. I don't know if we got enough yet, but let's take a look in our inventory. If we do, we'll head back to Beverly Hills for that. Two still, huh? We need another mutator. Alright, well this is the way we gotta go. Gives you like a little firework show. All right, so we got a ways to go. Does this take us out to? No, okay, I remember where this goes now.
Boom. Okay, I guess that's it here. I know I'm wasting ammo left and right, but with these, uh... It's a fun way to finish him off. I guess the last of our ammo, so it's back to the hammer. Or actually, let's go back to the rifle. Where is it? There it is. The Raven. Not the best weapon I got, but definitely not a bad one. We've done our uh, share of killing together. Silenced forever. Okay, constant. Did we do that? All right, so we're going to head back to Ocean Avenue and get to Serling Hotel because there's a ton of missions. That place is kind of like a hub for missions late game, or post regular game. Um, with Jimmy Montana having one, and then that wall will go ahead and pick up all the missing person ones. And just get them all into our inventory. I wish we had a third mutator heart, but we don't. Look who decided to show their face. I don't even think we can buy one. Uh, let's go ahead and pull these. Nadia's reported herself missing. <laughs> That's new. Jimmy wants everyone to weapon up. Well, Jimmy, I am weaponed up. Get rid of that. Get rid of that, that. I don't think we need to get rid of any more of this kind of stuff. Yeah, that buying. Um, Got three of those, so we can go ahead and clear out as many of those as we want. Food's here, but it's barely worth it. Okay, Janet. Tan is so cool, man. He's just sitting here jamming along. All right, where's Rosa? I don't. I guess I don't have to talk to her anymore. Yeah, I guess not. So, we're going to go to Beverly Hills. I know where there's a mutator there, kind of. I know we've looked for him a couple times. I think we found him at least once. So, hopefully we'll find him again and we can kill him. We can get him before he mutates even better, but... This will take care of that last one for that crazy lady doing the meat arc or whatever it is. It's the one I got active right now. The body arch red. So right up the street. 
We should have one. Now we're gonna go hammer time for this. Okay, we're just gonna try to ignore everybody pretty much. Do that every now and then to get him off our tail. I won't even look back at him. <laughs> yeah, this house usually has one. Or I say usually, I should say sometimes. See, there he is. Look at that. We killed him before he changed and we got the heart. That's awesome. So if you kill the mutator before he changes, that is fun because it saves you a huge fight. He's basically a walker at that point. Alright, now we'll run down the hill. Yeah, we'll just let all that mayhem go crazy. Francesco, we're coming to you, baby. You got a gift. You're gonna love it. Judgment Day. You must leave. I need total focus. She needs total focus. up to Ricky Rex's, leave the area, and come back. And that should let her move ahead and do what she has to do. It's worth it. It's totally worth it. So we'll just fast travel back to like Bel Air or whatever. And then we'll come back. Then we'll go check on her again. If that doesn't work, then it'll be next episode because we'll have to go do something else. Hopefully this has, uh, hopefully this is the end. We'll check the map. The map will tell us when we're here. So, yep, there she is. Alright, we'll head back down and talk to her. <laughs> you guys are going to love it. I've seen a mutator coming around this bend a couple times. So if you're looking for the hearts, I've seen it here. More than one occasion. Francesca! She can see she's not Maybe here she anymore. Disappeared up her own she's ass. back here. Oh. Isn't that horrible? Well? How does it make you feel? Like I'll never be the same again. Makes me feel disgusted. Yes. Facing the truth of our own grotesque reality is a miraculous experience. But see, you are free. You are absolved. God, I wish I were you. Everything before today was the looking glass. But now you're finally in Wonderland. Immerse yourself now, Alice. 
Let it enter every part of you. Well, Alice, have the scales fallen from your eyes? Do you comprehend? Weird. Now? Oh yeah. That thing is just so beyond disturbing. But what we got is kind of cool. So we got ourselves another legendary weapon, the Brutalizer. We're going to go ahead and just move that right up the list there. And let's take a look. We can upgrade. We can switch one out and fix something else. Uh... Damaging a zombie. There you go. Reinforced. We'll switch that out with... Killing a zombie. Nope, nope, nope. Not that one. Alright, just the basic damage. And we'll head back up to Ricky Rex's and try it on the way up there. Not too shabby. Very good at maiming. Not a bad machete, huh? Let's do a forceful attack. <laughs> yeah, it's another good addition to the arsenal. I believe there's eight altogether, and we are at half of them right now. So yeah, we got four more special weapons to go which is awesome all right guys well on that note we're going to go ahead and wrap up this episode of dead island 2 as always I'm captain beefy thanks so much for stopping by today if you haven't done so please subscribe to the channel ring that bell for notifications and don't forget to leave a like on this video it's a huge help for me i will see you guys next time until then peace